Xbox Scarlet is coming. Phil Spencer confirmed it, but the question is, how much will it cost? As we're going to talk about today on the pause menu, I'm Corey. This is Chris. As we said in our last video, next gen's coming. Xbox Scarlet is technically confirmed. They talked about they're making it, so whatever that means. Uh, but with Microsoft, it's a little different because there's rumors of the Xbox Scarlet Cloud, which is the streaming version, and then the more traditional Xbox Scarlet, whatever you want to call it, next Xbox. But with there being two, how much do you think they're going to cost? So, uh, I think I'm going to sound like a broken record. The highest that they can go is 500, and the lowest that they can go, the lowest that they will go, is 500. I feel like there's no reason why the non stream version, the normal version, will be 500. I feel like there isn't that convincing factor for them to take it any lower than that. Uh, like the Xbox One, when that came out, that was 500. And really, I feel like that didn't decrease right away. Like, I mean, that's that was the set price. Uh, I feel like that will be confirmed and the price of the Xbox Scarlet. I don't, I'm just, I don't see a 400 version of this uh, hardware console. I, I agree entirely. If Xbox Scarlet Cloud wasn't a thing, mm -hmm. but I, we, I, we, I guess we don't technically know Xbox Scarlet Cloud is a thing. Supposedly it is, but if Xbox Scarlet, I'm not saying it anymore, if Cloud is there, <laughs> I think you're right. I think that makes the, re the regular version $500. I think that's just the normal price of consoles. Yeah. I mean, I feel like that will become the steady pace unless uh, for, it's Nintendo. For Microsoft, I still think Sony's going to undercut them. I really do. Um, but... If there is not a streaming, if there's no Scarlet Cloud, I think they'll try 400. I think they'll try it. Again, um, I just think with the hardware that's going to be in that console, I don't think it can be that cheap. I mean, they'll take a loss on it. And, like they're not going to make money. Yeah, on we it. don't even know. Like, uh, you know, will it come with a uh, uh, the motion control thing? What is that called? Um, the Connect? Yeah. Will no, Connect oh, no. be a thing? No, no, no. no. With Scarlet? No way. Is, no. Connect, is Connect done? Connect is dead. It's well, dead and buried. Is there a voice control going to be a thing? Possibly. I, I think, just within the console? I think that, yeah, I, maybe they should put that array, you know, on, on a console. I'm surprised they actually didn't do that with the Xbox One X. I really think, I'm wondering how much hardware the Connect added to the price of the Xbox One. Yeah, probably about 100 bucks. Um, Because they, they eventually did release the Xbox One without the Connect True. for 400 So, um, but I mean, it... I think Microsoft is in a better position than Sony and Nintendo to take a loss because they are really pushing Game Pass. Game Pass, Game Pass, Game Pass, like an Xbox Live Gold. Like they want to make money on their services as well as their games. So I think to get consoles in the in the door, you got to make it worthy. But that's where Scarlet comes or Scarlet Cloud comes in. If Scarlet Cloud's a thing, 200 bucks. They'll charge 200 bucks for it and then 500 bucks for the Xbox Scarlet. If the Scarlet's not a thing, Four hundred bucks. I think Scarlet will be three hundred. I feel That's a like lot. I feel like two hundred is too cheap for being technically considered the next next gen uh, to release at two hundred. I mean, yes, the hardware is not there, but you're still getting all the games and maybe the features, online features that you would with your Xbox Scarlet mm -hmm. hardware. Like, I feel like I feel like three hundred would be a solid point for that. Three hundred to me is too close to four hundred, which is a weird thing to say, but. We're playing so many games right now. If the PS5 is four hundred dollars, I think the Scarlet has to be two because a hundred dollars isn't. It's a difference, but if you if a casual consumer was to walk into a store and they see an Xbox Scarlet Cloud for two hundred and a PS5 for four hundred, they're gonna look at that Scarlet pretty close. Like, why does this only have to cost? If it's three hundred, I think it's they're still more likely to pick yeah, up the PS5. But like where I'm saying it, if a Scarlet would be three hundred and then your Xbox. Uh, if your cloud would be 300 and then your hardware would be 500 I feel like that that's yeah. still a good balance right there. You're technically getting $200 off. You're not having an actual console and so forth. Uh, I don't know. But I just have 300 I just 200 <laughs> it just seems low. I, you're right, it does, but I think... I think Nothing, the... No consoles sell for 200 GameCube did. Well, no, I mean, new, this generation. <laughs> no, you're right, but like, it's, this... it's not a console. Like, it's, it's not going to cost more than $200 to make, that's for sure. Um, but it's, I think their play is, is they don't care how you get to the, you know, they don't care how you get to Gears of War 5. They just wanted to get Do you we, to it. Like, is it, I'm just trying to imagine what the cloud's going to look like compared to what the Scarlet's going to look like. It's like, is it still, is it a box? Does it, will it look like Scarlet? Like. it's a good question. I, I think it'll probably be Will they just like give a, you like a little like hard drive? Yeah, more like a puck. Like a, <laughs> just put it down and, and get a like little. Controllers can connect to? Well, it's all going to be wireless, I hope. Is it? I, 
Do you think maybe be? maybe there's just going to be a special TV. <laughs> Scarlet TV? I, Isn't that what Sony did? Uh, Didn't not, they come out with a TV? Yeah, they did. It was like PlayStation a, Now TV, I think, or something like that? Some of the Bravias, I think you can do not PlayStation well, that's, Now. On, that's yeah. a whole other Anyways, yeah, so, so you're saying 500. 500 and 300. Okay, I'm going to go, again, mine's a little different. If Scarlet Cloud is a thing, 200 and 500. If it's not, 400. If Scarlet Cloud's not a thing... 500. <laughs> I just, that's the <laughs> solid price. I cannot see a console with the hardware that we're getting lower than 500. Like, I feel like it, I mean, yeah, I mean, it was more expensive than the PS4, you know, when they, when the Xbox One came out. But, like, I felt like they were confident with 500, and I feel like they will still will be confident with that. We can all agree, nothing more than 500. I yeah, mean, that's, they, yeah, that's the yeah. max you can go. It just doesn't work after that. So here, here's my question: If Sony goes 400, does Microsoft go 500? 500. Mm -hmm. I feel like they won't take that loss. Like, I mean, like they have probably the option to take that loss. I feel like they won't do. If Scarlet Cloud's a thing, I don't think they will. So but... okay, so if if PlayStation 4 is, uh, maybe you said this 5. and I just PlayStation 5. Maybe you did say this and I just wasn't paying attention. How much you, you say the Scarlet will be hardware Scarlet? 500. If it's if the PlayStation Five four hundred, if I, I agree with you in that, I think they're going to go five hundred no matter what. Okay. If if Scarlet Cloud isn't a thing or is a thing, because uh, I think they're going to use Scarlet Cloud as their you know we're still cheaper could, than Sony. Could they both be five hundred? Not this cloud, the cloud PlayStation Five and they Scarlet? could. I I still think I think Sony's going to go four because you know, I and, I would I would just love to see the same price because that's where you can right, really you can see the statistics see it, right. behind it. See what see who's got better marketing, who's got better be, shebang. Like, uh, yeah, I I think they both can do that. That'd be interesting. I mean, it, watching the PS4 and Xbox One, that was a fascinating time to be a gamer. Like, just watching the comments and the war, and yeah. just like, oh man, like at that time I was, you know, we were full into writing and all that, and, and some of the names I got called for buying an Xbox One was and ridiculous. This year, <laughs> we're gonna see Xbox go portable gaming. No, no way. Uh, they need something to compete with the V. Oh, oh too soon. Yeah. Too soon. <laughs> That's going to do it. Let us know how much you think Xbox Scarlet is going to cost. Is this Xbox Scarlet Cloud a thing? Yes, no. Can we play Xbox Scarlet Cloud on a tablet? I don't see why not. It's got a chip in it. Let us know in the comments below. Hit that like and subscribe button. It really helps us out, and we will see you next time.